Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. Because copper and bronze are not magnetic with even the strongest magnets, you can narrow down your options. Keep in mind that while brass is magnetic, it is very slight. If you take a very heavy-duty magnet and hold it close to a brass object, chances are the object will attract the magnet. Take our lead. Bronze is a great metal to scrap and is always worth more than brass, but less than copper. Bronze generally consists of 90% copper and 10% zinc. Bronze has a high scrap value when you want to cash it in. You can always get paid cash at our yard on the spot. Let's help you make your mark. Update. Which is most expensive? Brass, bronze or copper? While it can vary depending on which grades you are comparing, Typically copper is the most expensive of the three red metals. Bronze is usually more expensive than brass, partly due to the processes required to manufacture bronze. Take our lead. To distinguish copper from brass, which is an alloy of other metals, examine the color under good white light. Real copper should have a reddish-brown hue, like a penny. Brass items tend to have a yellowish tint. If your item is yellow, orange-yellow or even has elements of gray, you are probably dealing with brass. Make your mark, take our lead. Metals that don't attract magnets in their natural states. Metals such as aluminum, brass, copper, gold, lead and silver don't attract magnets because they are weak metals. However, you can add properties such as iron or steel to the weak metals to make them stronger. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.